Hi there, and welcome to another blog post on chrisryan.ca. I'm sitting here with Stephen Ling. He's a friend of mine, and he's a, he's a lawyer here in HRM. I've currently, or sorry, I've used him many times for real estate transactions for myself, as well as family members uh, and many, many clients over the years. So I'm asked several uh, legal questions um, from buyers and sellers and so on. So I thought I would come over and, and ask a few to Stephen, and then I'll, uh, and then everybody can benefit from it. So one of the questions that I'm asked about uh, on a regular, somewhat regular basis, are what are the requirements for property insurance when someone's going to have a mortgage? Well, on all all mortgages, they have covenants in there that the that the person getting the mortgage from the bank has to meet. One of those requirements is have appropriate insurance in place to insure the property for all risks, which is primarily fire insurance, but also other things. So it's, it's absolutely a requirement of closing for the client to bring in what is called an insurance binder confirmation. Mm -hmm. And that's a standard document that all the insurance agents and insurance providers in the city and <clears throat> throughout the country would know what it was. It would have a standard mortgagee endorsement clause showing the loss payment pay on the fire insurance to be the bank right. that they're using. So they're basically they're, they're securing their asset. They're securing their asset and securing the bank because they've covenanted with the bank they'd have the insurance in place. Right. And during the due diligence of uh, you know for for a buyer or a seller, the buyer one of the things that they have to produce is a letter of insurability that I would deal with. Um, so you have to have your financing approval letter as a buyer, you have to have your letter of insurability, and this is the first part of that. So making sure that they are able to receive property insurance because we know that if they're going to have a mortgage, which most people have, you have to have property insurance in place, and all of that comes into place at closing. Correct. That's correct. Excellent. Thank you.